Hey everyone, this is Muriel. This is my last beef stash for the evening. It's actually Miss Cooper's Coop after dark because it's 1130, but I just want to get this done. So in the morning, I they are boxed up and ready to go if I get a person who is interested in them. So this is another de-stash. It is um, more or less Christmas papers and um, just some collections that I have used but haven't used all of them. And then there's lots of cardstock and just a bunch of stuff. So US only, PayPal only, friends and family preferred. If you're interested, leave a comment down below and let's get started. This I believe is plain cardstock. Some patterns on them. Me. You can kind of see we have some stripes. Just make sure it's not double. Okay. Some stripe and some um, diamond patterns. And then there is just some solid. It is double sided. It's probably that white core paper, you know. Remember that? This seems to be lots of red. And then there is the white. Okay. So we have that. And then we have some really pretty blue and green cardstock. This is some Making Memories paper. Um, I used to buy the kits where it had everything in it and you can just make something a page. But what's left of this is just some um, red cardstock. Um, I don't think that, that's trash. Some beautiful green, another piece of red. Here's another green. Here is a um, die cut page of tags. And then some more green and some more red. Okay, I'll keep that together. And then there's Seven Gypsy. This is a um, Santa's Journey Collection Santa's Trunk. So it's Christmas related. On the back, it looks like that. Probably make a good cover for a journal book. My Mind's Eye. This is a blue um, paper. I don't know if it's Christmas related, but it's pretty. Here is some green. Green trees. And then another shade of green. This is all pattern paper. There are some snowflakes. And then this blue, like a snow drift. Some more snowflakes, pretty greens. Those two here. Here is a Christmas words that could be cut out maybe. There's one that has been cut out already. Okay. There is some paper that the gold, the silver are raised. I don't know what this is called, but it's probably like a fabric. Just feel the dots on that. Here is some white paper, well, background, and this is some snowmen, some uh, snowflake stickers, and this paper here says um, January. I used to have a whole year of them, but I don't know where they are. We may find them in here. There is some blue paper here. This is beautiful snowflake vellum. Probably would make gorgeous rosettes. And then there's another blue. Here is a sheet. It just says celebrate, which could be cut out, put on a uh, junk journal maybe. Here is um, another Christmas paper. And there's some green here. This one here is vintage Christmas. Fort Mary on the bottom. The opposite side looks like this. It's from Vintage Christmas, My Mind's Eyes. And then in here, there is a few stickers left. Um, here are some more stickers. Those are seals to go on the back of your envelopes. Some more sticker tags just for you. For all these cute labels for Christmas that you can use on your projects. 
If you give cookies at Christmas time, you can put this on the jar or on the boxes. I tend to make pretzels. So all of those. Then you have this sheet here of light blue alphabets and some of the um, words down below, some sticker die cuts. And then there's this shade sheet here. Some of the tags are missing, but there is a quite a bit left. And then some more alphabet sheets. What was that? Oh, just a piece of paper. And then a couple more um, cute little um, stickers that could, could be used. And then we have Authentique. Now, I used this two years ago. For two years, I made uh, winter cards with these, but I'm not going to be doing that this year. So um, this is a uh, frosted pad is what it's called. Beautiful winter papers. I have like some friends whose birthdays are in January and I would make their cards from this pad here. So there's a few of the cutouts that I have not used, the cut aparts. Um, really cute. I love the blues. There's some cards that are already cut or some paper, right, that could be used. Here is some purple and teal cardstock and some lavender. So I don't want to pull it out, but there is quite a bit in here. There's still a whole sheet of the um, cut aparts. And on the opposite side, there are these, the ones here, which are really, really pretty. And then the rest are the pattern papers. So it's a beautiful collection by Authentique. They do nothing but the best. Okay, so there's plenty in here. Okay. Let me close this up. I don't want it to fall out. Okay, then there is a my a, a very Merry Christmas uh, sticker sheet with alphabets, big and small, and then some down here that look like um, they're on like book paper, newspaper. Then there is this sticker sheet from Basic Gray. Again, lots of large and small alphas, red and blue. This is from their blush collection. And the same thing here. This is from their fruitcake collection. Some more really distressed blue and green alphabets, big and small, and numbers, and a few characters. Then there is this Heidi Swaps paper pad. It's called Believe. I've used this many a times. Again, there is quite a bit of the scraps in here that can be used. This paper doesn't go out of style. It just, you do something different to it than someone else. And they'll be saying, what is that paper pad from? And then they will remember. This is really cute. Those can be punched out. You could use those to make an advent calendar. So there's quite a bit in here. Okay, there's that one. And then there is this one here. I talked about this. these two I wanted to keep because I knew I had a paper pad that would kind of blend. So this is the Bow Bunny Sleigh Ride Collection. Again, I've used this to make um, tags, I believe, and cards, but it's really, really pretty, very um, woodsy and uh, cozy and um, cottagey. Um, it just reminds me of going um, sledding or skiing. Really pretty. So there's quite a bit of paper here. There is a sticker sheet what's left on the back. Okay. And then I have these um, Noteworthy by Bo Bunny. These are the journaling uh, spots or things that go with the collection that could easily match up with this one here. So that completes my Christmas paper pads if you're interested again leave me that comment down below and um if i don't hear from you tonight then in the morning i will check my email and uh hopefully someone will have responded and uh hopefully you'll pay within the hour and again when i leave in the morning 
this will be part of the package going to the post office. So thank you guys a lot. Again, this is um, just one lot of Christmas paper that is $23 D-stash. Thanks again. Bye now.